Alright gamers, we're back in another one um, here in Hawaii, actually in my hotel room. Um, but today we're reacting to a day in the life of DJ Loves Turbo, so let's get into it. Yo, I'm doing a day in the life. Everybody always wants to see what do YouTubers do in their everyday life. Is their life super busy? Is their life super boring? You're going to figure out how my life goes every day. And I just moved to Arizona, so it's a bit more heck. Yo, I live in Arizona too. What part of Arizona did this guy move to? I live in Phoenix. Now than it used to be. I used to live in a small town in Illinois. I Illinois. just made videos all day, so it wasn't going to be cool to show you a day in the life. But now that I live in Arizona, there's a lot more that I do. There's a lot more to... Hold up. Go back. ...cool to show you a day in the life. But now that I live in Arizona, there's a lot more that I... No, I don't know that sign in the background. I do. There's a lot more to do here in Arizona. And right now, actually, I'm going to Best Buy. I'm going to take you along. I have to go to Best Buy right now to get something for this camera because if you can see right now, I don't know if you can see, but if you can see in the reflection, I'm holding this camera with my hand. Tonight, I have a bunch of things I'm going to be doing, so I thought I'd just bring my camera, show you what I do every day. All right, we're at Best Buy. Hold up. I hope they take this. That looks familiar. I hope they accept this. I don't have the receipt, so they better accept it or... I'm going to sue them. I don't care. They have this thing. This thing is 60 bucks. Man. This is 60, 60 bucks, bucks for a cell phone stick? This little okay. tripod. Yeah, right. So a lot of people, a lot of YouTubers, they get this, the Gorilla Pod. Guess how much this is? This is how like, much? It looks like that, right? Guess how, how much? much it is? $79. 80 bucks? I don't have that money, dude. I'm broke. So the guy didn't want to take back the thing because I didn't have a receipt. So I beat him up and then went behind the counter, scanned it myself, and then refunded my, my own card. Sure you did. Sure you did, buddy. Sure you did. So if I stop uploading videos, that's why. But we got our money back. We got the new, got the, we got the new thing so I don't have to hold my camera up with my hand anymore. All right, let's see. Sure, buddy. Did he actually do that? 100% no thing is even good a <laughs> lot of all right a lot of youtubers use this i've actually had this before i had it at my old house back in my hometown but but i don't have one here in arizona and i haven't used one in a very long time what the fuck so i think i just <laughs> screw this onto here hold on you're gonna you might you might get a little dizzy i'm spinning this camp bro this is not connecting what nah He's really going to put that in his I video. I just saw these on the floor of my car. You might be saying, why do you have baby sunglasses? Well, I had a volleyball tournament this weekend, right? And when I got there, I realized, oh my gosh, this the Sorry. sun is bright. So I ordered some glasses off of Postmates. It's pretty much where people will go buy you something and bring it to you. So I looked for some glasses. I bought the cheapest ones. They were like 10 bucks. This is what they look like, bro. Hey, they ain't bad. They ain't bad. This is what they look like. They Are you serious? Them. Bro, it's super sunny out too. So these these glasses are actually helping a little bit. I hope nobody like sees me. Like if I see it. The only clip of DJ loves turbo with sunglasses on in existence. A girl or something. I hope she does not see me because this is going to be very embarrassing. Man, embarrassing. I will not more worried about the girls I'm just about making it home. than his One thing own I need to health? Do is I need to eat something. I don't think I've eaten much today. I can't even remember what I did eat today. This is a real man fair. Yo, I just woke up. Normally, Talking I with his mouth full. I hate that. I start my day by getting breakfast like, you know, most people do. One thing about Arizona is you don't have trash cans in the front of your house. I feel like most of the time people have trash cans outside at the front of their house. Okay, that's 100% not true. Not all houses in Arizona have those. Some of them do, in fact. Most of them don't. Most of them either have, like, the big dumpsters that you have to take your trash to, or you have the dumpsters in your backyard that you have to take out to the curb. So that's 100% not true. Well, in Arizona, we have an alley in the back of our houses where there's a big dumpster. But it's kind of cool. It keeps the yeah, again, that that's not true. So only some houses have the, that. Um, yeah. In front of your house looking pretty, you don't have a... 
big stupid trash can out in the front, you know. So I've been in Arizona for like the past week or so. I'm. I think I might know where he lives. Moved here a week ago, and every single day has been beautiful. It's super warm, super sunny, barely any clouds, barely any rain. Arizona is awesome. I got a new uh, food and water bowl for my cat. Arizona is not awesome. You should. He ha, he should just wait during the summer summer for the summer if he wants to say that it's awesome. He should wait till the summer. Hundred fifteen degrees, man. Cats, as you can see right here, it's kind of cool. It's it's a little bit higher up, so the cats don't have to bend over. So right now I'm about to go get some breakfast, but then after I get breakfast. I heard about this trail that's close to my house. It's like a little walking trail, and apparently it goes in a weird neighborhood, and it's super cool. And it's so I want to go down that walking trail and just see what it's like. I'll bring my camera. I went ahead and ordered. Let's some see food. where I'm it is. Pick it up when it's done. I didn't want to just go in and eat by myself. I feel like imagine he's living in Tucson, and I'm in Phoenix. I'm like, hmm, is that? Do I know where that is? No, I don't. It's in Tucson. Everybody will be staring at me like, look at this sports. I've been to Tucson twice, once. Never go to sports clips. They will make you bald. Oh, my. I've been looking for some really cool paintings, and I just I just walked into this random store. And look at this painting. I think that is awesome. That painting is... That is an awesome painting. $700. Man. $800 for that painting. Oh my, I might have to rethink my decision or I might have to cancel my breakfast to get that. See, like, in my opinion, a couch like this, I hate it. I hate that. I would I hate would that. I would throw that away if I worked here. That's not a bad table. I really like wood. I like natural <coughs> paws on that. My I like bad. natural Excuse colors, me? natural tones. Like this, these bed sheets, I absolutely hate. It just reminds me of, like, old people. I don't, I, like I don't like that. I don't like that. There's a bunch of cool things here, but but a lot of this is expensive. Like that one painting I liked was eight hundred dollars. I really like this painting too. How much is this? Seven seven ninety five again. So both of the paintings that I like are both seven hundred ninety five dollars. I thought this place was cool, but I looked Plus at the tax. prices and I realized tax in Arizona is like nine percent, eight percent, eight and a half maybe. This is not my type. I'm a broke man, dude. I'm a broke boy, so. I gotta leave. I don't feel right here. I'm leaving. All right, so I got my food. I made it back home, and I ordered something that I kind of regret ordering, but at the same time, I don't regret it. It's called Billionaire's Bacon. It's bacon with, like, some gold on it or whatever. I think this one strip of bacon was, like, $20. I'm going to try it right now. Look at the gold, bro. Look at the gold on that bacon. All right, you ready? I cannot believe okay. how much more productive my writing sessions have become since I started using Grammarly, especially as a um, native English Can I speaker. move this Video and script. skip? Okay. I've never wanted to eat gold before. Like, I'm literally eating gold. I mean, it's edible gold. And it tastes good. I also got a bunch of fruit. It's probably like pure sugar or it's just tasteless. And I got some really beautiful French toast. I have never seen French toast that looks like this. Oh, oh my God. God. That bacon. French toast is so intricate, man. Are you serious? I just got done eating. The food was pretty good. That bacon was good. But I wish dang, you would just say where it's from. I'm probably never getting that again because I'm broke. But I'm about to walk over to that trail. It's somewhere in my neighborhood. I'm going to have to find it. I think it's somewhere over here. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go over here, walk around until we get there. Broke boy with the Tesla. Times. I've seen the broke boy with the Tesla. Tons of people walking on this trail. Apparently it goes into like like a little valley. It's right next to this elementary school. So that would be cool to see a bunch of kids outside, you know, enjoying the day. Another thing I've noticed is that people in Arizona, they don't even have like grass in their front yard. But like that's rocks. That's rocks. This is rocks. That's rocks. Okay, some of us do. Some of us do. This has got to be the worst sprinkler I have ever seen. Do you see this? Oh, yeah, we have a lot of those. Because the heat dries up the water and then all the minerals get stuck inside of the sprinkler and clog it up. Are you serious? All right, so this is like... During the summer. Mostly. Mostly. Cool trail everybody's talking about. 
It goes all the way down there, and it goes all the way down here. There's a random toy just on the ground. What the? Look at this. I don't want to touch it. What if it's like a bomb or something? Oh, I know where he is. He's in um, Peoria, I think. Um, and then I think the elementary school is like the sharks or something. I don't know why they would have a shark. Um, but we'll see. What the f <laughs> At least he kicked it. Oh yeah, we have it's a like lot of those too. You see that? Like a lot. So yeah, that's pretty much my life. I didn't show you everything though. Like I didn't show you me working on my main channel videos. I didn't show you me recording videos. I didn't show you me hanging out with friends or family. Any YouTuber that says, oh, I go do this, I go on my Lamborghini, then I swim on in a private ocean, they're probably lying. Most of us YouTubers just sit around, make videos, and just act like normal humans, man. My next videos are going to be back to normal. The reason I've been vlogging so much is because I don't have enough equipment. I didn't get the right equipment when I moved down here, so I'm mm, waiting for that, stuff to come. That makes day. sense. And mail. Amazon sent me the wrong package, so I'm waiting for my actual package to come. So Amazon, it's something with Arizona. No one, nowhere I've ever been other than Arizona has had such bad Amazon service, I guess you could say. Like, packages arriving, never too late, ne never arriving, arriving with the wrong stuff. It's that kind of stuff that you can only find in Arizona, you know. So... I think it'll be I'm probably wrong. I haven't been that that many places, but um, usually Arizona for me. If you want to see me do some more stuff in real life, I guess I'll do it. I'm really weird. I'm stupid too, so I guess that could be fun to watch. Tell me what I should do in real life. Bye. <laughs> Man, what the frick was that ending face? that thing um anyways thank you guys for watching make sure to like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next video peace